So this is the inside of the JBL Junior Pop Bluetooth speaker. And in case you want to replace the battery in it, or you're just curious to find out how this thing looks inside, then this is the video that you want to watch. So we're going to take this apart today and I'm going to show you how this is done. Yeah, so first of all here, this thing looks really rugged and there isn't really any location where you can see where to open it. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to heat up here the outside of this uh, rubbery or silicon material here. So we're going to heat that up in order to loosen it a little bit. So, and I am going to use here my good old blow dryer to do this. Uh, it takes a couple of minutes with this, so I'm going to warm this up. I'm going to skip this so you don't have to watch me do this. And I'm also wearing here some really thick leather gloves so I don't burn my hands here while I'm doing this. Yeah, so here a couple of minutes into heating up this material here, you can uh, sort of bend this away from the center part here. You see here this black shiny area showing up there. This is the actually speaker housing. And I'm going to pry this open a little bit all around so that I can have access to this uh, plastic cover that covers the uh, transducer. So now since I'm curious, I uh, go a little bit over the top here and I'm removing way more of the silicone here than is necessary. I'm just really curious and maybe you want to find out too what's behind this when you take off more of the silicone. So uh, here you can see on the side this is where the holes are for the buttons. This is what you push and then here's the uh, charging port and uh, the hole in the, in the rubber here and then there's not much else to it. I can't say if the uh, holes here, if those are still waterproof at this point, so if there's, uh, if it's still sealed. But now let's get going with uh, looking into the inside of the speaker here. So let's continue with the teardown. And now, so it's time here to remove this cover here of the transducer. And then what I'm doing is I uh, heated up this plastic piece a little bit and then you can use your knife here, my good old knife, to pry off this plastic cover. See, this is uh, really glued on, glued on really well. Uh, so this is what this looks like. See here, there's this orange membrane behind there. And then we have here four screws that hold the uh, transducer in the middle in place. And then if you just check out here the outside ring, this white one here, that's where the LEDs are be sitting behind. So that's where all the light comes through. So let's check this actually out, how this lo looks like, how this ring looks like if we now turn on the speaker. Yeah, look at this. This doesn't look too bad either, just without the uh, cover, the JBL with the JBL logo on it. Looks pretty neat. Here, if I put the uh, cover back on, then you can uh, see the difference here, the difference that this makes when you uh, take it off. And now I continue here with uh, removing the four Phillips screws here. And then you can uh, use a small screwdriver and basically pry off the entire front here of the speaker, including the white ring for the LEDs. And you pop off here the uh, cover. Uh, remember, there's the transducer still connected to the board. So you're going to remove the connector here before you uh, rip it off by accident. Now here we have the uh, board. You can see this. We have here a total of five buttons that go here through the to the sides. So you can push this here through those holes in the uh, housing. And then in the center here, we have all the LEDs. How many do we have here? Eight LEDs maybe? Eight LEDs total. And then the board also, we can see here these uh, solder joints here for the battery. 
but that's uh, on the opposite side of the board so we have to check that out but now let's first take a look here at the leds and let's turn them on let's just see what happens how this looks like when they are open up and now we can uh, see their spiel here let's enjoy this a little bit And then we continue by removing three more uh, Phillips screws. And then we can take out the board here. Have a look at the back side. What do we have here? You can see here one more connector. That goes straight here to the micro USB charging port. This is where this is connected. And then we have also here the battery connection this is soldered onto the board and then they uh, put some glue on it i guess to secure it and that goes here to the back of the housing that's where the uh, battery is in it's actually covered here with a little bit of plastic so let's take that off and then have a closer look at the battery here so this is what a, the sticker looks like so if you want to have a look at those at the writing here maybe pause the video here for a second we just keep going because we want to have here some more close-ups here of the boards so here's the front side and the back side once more so you can see all the details see what parts are on here and so this is already it yeah so tear down of the JBL Junior Pop Bluetooth speaker I hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have any questions, then leave a comment below.